Hello everyone, welcome to our channel. Today we are going to talk about verb tenses. Let's start by talking about verb tense. A verb tense express the time of an event or action. Zaman al-afal يعبر عن يعني الوقت الذي حدث فيه حدث معين أو نعم حدث معين. Time and how it is expressed in writing is very important to English readers. يعني الزمن أو الوقت الذي حدث فيه الحدث فهو مهم جدا بالنسبة للغة الإنجليزية. The English language has 12 different tenses. In this lesson, we will review the meaning of each verb tense. يعني لدينا 12 tense. Let's start by the simple present tense. The simple present tense expresses a habit. يعني عادة يعبر عن عادة or often repeated action أو الأحداث التي تعاد أو تتكرر. Adverbs of frequency such as often, seldom, sometimes, never. etc. are used with this tense. يعني adverbs of frequency يقدم لنا إشارات بأننا يجب أن نستعمل simple present. For example, she goes to work every day. They always sit. Sorry, they always eat lunch together. So, when we have adverb of frequency or adverbs of frequency we need to use the simple present in this case for example the simple present this is a line a timeline in which there are actions that happen in simple present we also use the simple present tense to express general truth in Samil present simple تعبير عن حقائق العامة for example تشرق الشمس من الشرق the sunrise from the east we need to use simple present or we use simple present with facts that are timeless نستعمل يعني مع حقائق التي لا تتغير مع مرور الزمن نستعمل مع simple present for example snow falls in December or water falls at 100 degrees now let's try to move to the present progressive the present progressive or the present continuous the present continuous is used to describe an action that is occurring right now in Samuel present continuous لتعبير عن حدث الذي وقع في اللحظة التي نتحدث معنا at this moment or today أو اليوم or this year في هذه السنة the difference between simple present and present progressive is there is a period of time لدينا مدة زمنية for example the action has begun and is still in progress so the present continues بدأت يعني بدأ الحدث في لحظة معينة في الزمن ويستمر للحظة التي نتحدث فيها لازال الحدث يأخذ الوقت for example she is typing a paper for her class كان تكتب في إنها تكتب يعني ورقة أو تكتب رسالة إذا أو غير ذلك يعني الحدث يأخذ حدث الكتابة يأخذ مدة زمنية هو في الحاضر he can't talk he is fixing he is fixing the verb fixing or the action fixing takes a period of time in in a present now let's move to present progressive It, it can also be used to describe an action that is occurring in the present, but it is 
but is temporary. For example, June is living in Modesto, but he might move soon. ممكن أن أنا برو سيمال بزنس كي بروغرسيف أو بزنس كونتينيوس على حدث لي ممكن أن يتغير في المستقبل يعني حدث الآن هي إز ليفين يعيش في لكن مستقبلا ممكن أن يتغير الوضع The simple past The past For example We use the simple past ماضي to indicate exactly when an action or event took place in the past. نستعمل يعني الماضي للتعبير على الحدث أو الوقت الذي وقع فيه الحدث في الماضي. For example, I visited Edi. We add Edi. I visited my sister yesterday. Yesterday, we went. We went out to dinner last. Night. The simple past is used to describe actions and or events that are now completed. يعني نعبر نستعمل simple past لتعبير عن حدث أو أحداث وقعت في الماضي وانتهت في الماضي. And no longer true in this present. والآن غير هذه الأحداث ليست حقيقية. حدث في الماضي. An action in the past. For example, I attended an event. For example, in 1998, the time in the past, the exact time or the year. I no longer attend. MGC. I saw a movie. I saw in the past a movie. She had to every weekend when I was a teenager. يعني كنت أشاهد يعني a film every weekend. I don't see movies now. الآن لا أشاهد هذه الأفلام لكن من قبل في الماضي in the past كنت أشاهد الأفلام كل Weekend. The past progressive or the past continuous. The past progressive is used to talk about an activity, nasha, that was in progress. Ladi kana ya ya yata tawar or na yata tawar at a specific point of time in the past. Nani au ladi samara ni muda. The emphasis is on the duration of the activity. And we focus on the time of the activity. Meaning, what we did in the past. In the past, 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 While my mother was cooking dinner, for the past progressive, ممكن أنا يكون لنا حدثين حدث قاع في الماضي لكن أخذ مدة زمنية past progressive والحدث الذي حدث بعده حدث بسرعة when my mother arrived. So it is simple. Past. Simple past. Like, hold the time. But past progressive or past continuous needs a period of time. The past progressive also is often used with the simple past to show that one action was in progress when another action occurred. Any شرح الذي قمنا به. Any حدث حدث الذي حدث في past progressive يأخذ مدة زمنية ويقع حدث آخر simple past so for example I was talking I was taking a bath 
when the door rang. Doorbell rang. For example, I was taking a period of time when the the bell rang. So another example: They were eating dinner when the neighbors stopped. Stopped. Were eating. Wife. For a visit. Stopped by, okay. It's attached. The present perfect is used to talk about an event that began in the past and continues up to the present. You need to have and present continue and present perfect and had us began. بدأ في الماضي واستمر لا الحاضر. For example, الحدث, the action or the event, another event. So it is continuing. For example, he has lived in Modesto for two years. استمر الحدث من الماضي إلى الحاضر. He began living. ولكن ينتهي الحدث بعد قبل الحديث عنه. Two years ago, okay, he lived. He has lived in Modesto for two years. He began living in Modesto two years ago, and he still lives there. ممكن أن الحدث يستمر إلى الحاضر. The present perfect. For the present perfect, that is also used to talk about an event that was completed in the past. ممكن أن نسمى present perfect للحديث عن حدث بدأ في الماضي وانتهى في الحاضر. But the specific time of the event is not important. لكن يعني الزمن المحدد الذي انتهى في الحدث ليس مهم. For example, I have seen the movie before. I have seen the movie before. The specific time is not important. In his time, the day when he had his first day, all the day is not important. He has already visited Vietnam or America. Specific dates and times are not mentioned. Present perfect progressive. For the present progressive, perfect progressive, it is used to describe the duration, the تعبير عن المدة الزمنية of an action that began in the past, حدث بدأ في الماضي, and continue into the present. والذي استمر إلى الحاضر. لكن يأخذ مدة زمن زمنية. For example, he has been studying grammar for an hour. يعني حدث أخذ مدة زمنية مستمرة. She has been cooking all day. For present perfect, progressive is also used to describe events that have been in progress. You see, I'm like that. The تعبير عن الأحداث التي م م تس التي نزلت مستمرة أو التي استمرت recently and are rather temporary. For example, she has been living in Taiwan in Taiwan for the last two months, but she plans to move on. يعني الحالة أو الحدث أو الفعل مستمر إلى الحاضر لكن هناك مخطط لتغيير مكان السكن. She has been living in in Taiwan. نيب بشكل مؤقت. For the past perfect, past perfect, this tense describes completed events. يصف لنا هذا الزمن. الأحداث التي انتهت 
that took place in the past before another past event يعني التي انتهت قبل حدوث حدث آخر for example the Titanic had received many warnings before it hit the iceberg يعني قبل أن تستطيع التايتانيك ب الايسبرغ جبل الجليد تلقت تايتانيك مجموعة من التحذيرات I had already eaten my friend stopped by to visit I had already eaten يعني تناولت يعني for example, dinner uh, for our lunch. قبل أن يزورني صديقي. يعني نجد أن هناك حدثين حدث استمر لمدة زمنية أنا والأكل وحدث جاء بعده يعني ب الذي لم يأخذ مدة زمنية visited or هيت يعني يقع في لحظة معينة في الماضي in the past for example had received or had eaten period of time then you have it hit or my friend stopped by now past perfect progressive is used to emphasize the duration نستعمل بس past perfect continuous لي يعني لوضع أو لتقديم أهمية أكثر للمدة الزمنية التي حدثت للمدة الزمنية التي أخذها الحدث that was completed before another action والذي انتهى قبل يحدث حدث آخر في الماضي in the past for example she had been driving كانت يعني she had been driving كانت تسوق or كانت سائقة around the city for three hours before she finally found يعني كانت تمارس وفعل سياقة في لمدة زمنية تتراوح بين ثلاث ساعات before قبل she finally found the right office قبل أن تجد المكتب المناسب أو الصحيح had been driving which is there is a duration or a period of time for an event okay period period of time long time she found the right act office it is a short action now let's talk about the future we have we use this is the form of the future will and be it will be for example going plus going to or often used to describe the future actions it is a form that is used to describe the future an action in the future this is the timeline and this is the future the past the present thomas will graduate in june for example will thomas will graduate in june it is future mary Maria is going to go to Mexico next week or next year. This is the future. The, the simple present and the present progressive are also used to express future time. Any mumkin and Samuel simple present and present progressively tabir and in Mustaqbal. These are often used in connection with schedules يعني نستعملها في الغالب من اجل بشكل مرتبط بسكيدول بلان شي حاجه اللي اننا 
قمنا بتخطيط لها for example she is meeting a new client at 11 o'clock see present progressive or present continuous but it is about the future she is meeting so for تلتقي the train leaves at 6 so uh, يغادر القطار مع السادسة يعني ممكن أننا نتحدث عن المستقبل السادسة okay now let's talk about the future progressive there is a progress for example this tense is used to describe an event or action that will occur over a period of time at a specific point in the future حدث معين في وقت معين في المستقبل I will be teaching English as a second language Okay, tomorrow. يعني وقت محدد في المستقبل. They will be moving their furniture out of the house by the time you arrive tomorrow. This is about the future. It is a duration and then an action in the future. The future perfect. We have two actions. For example, or let's read this before this tense is used to describe an event or action that will be completed before another event or time in the future يعني نستعمل future perfect للتعبير عن حدث وقع will be completed وانتهى سيقع وينتهي قبل حدوث حدث آخر. For example, we have we will have finished. سنكون قد انتهينا the exam in امتحان by the time classes end tomorrow. يعني سننتهي من الامتحان قبل انتهاء الحصة غدا. Future progressive describes an action. يسف حدث that has been in progress الذي كان مستمرا for a duration لمدة من الزمن before another event in the future قبل حدث معين في المستقبل for example by the time he finishes low class low school or low classes we will have been living in the US for 8 years يعني سنكون قد Uh, okay. استقرنا في الـ US لمدة ثمان سنوات تزامنا مع الوقت الذي سينهي فيه دروسه في مدرسة القانون أو كلية القانون Thank you for your attention